Once upon a time, in a wild, wild world, there were two wolf brothers living in their home lair with their papa wolf. They all lived happily together, but one day, hunters took their dad away. Forever. So now the brothers were alone. And they had to find a new home. That's when the big brother discovered that the little one was not an ordinary wolf, but a super wolf. And then they worked together to learn how to use his power and to follow the rules for them. They discovered a secret hideout where they could train day and night. They were happy. But the little wolf got very sick. So they had to move on. On the way, a deadly predator attacked them. But they scared it away. They decided to journey to the home of their nearby ancestors to seek help. Finally, the tired and hungry brothers made it to the home of their ancestors. The old wolves invited them to stay. They even took care of them. They were happy to have a safe, warm place to rest. The little wolf even made friends with a raccoon, and together they went on awesome adventures. Unfortunately, the hunters were hot on their trail and found them. But the old wolves helped the brothers escape. The brothers had nowhere to stay again, so they decided to keep going south to the distant homeland of their papa wolf. No way, you little shit. Daniel, get your ass over here now. <sighs> He's so busted. Of course, like I want to play fucking hide and seek.
be anywhere. Oh, shit. Whoa, hold on. Let go! S stop it! Dude, I told you to stay out of my room. Ow! That hurt! Yeah, I'm not fucking around anymore. Got it? Do you hear me, Daniel? You shall not enter your brother's room. Watch out, man! You started it, dickhead! What is this crap? Are you fighting again? You proud of yourself? Stop it! Enough! Getting tired of this. Sean, what happened? Now! Dad, I told him not to come so into my room. He never listens. He hit me and broke the trophy. He's lying. He always does that when he gets busted. Little shit. Enough! You both better listen because I'm tired of this crap. Okay? This is my house too, not your playground. You hear me? Jeez. You guys are working my last nerve this week. You okay, mijo? I'm going to talk with your brother. You know the drill. Bedroom and no games. I didn't do anything! Uh-huh. Let's talk. Oh, now. This is so stupid! It's bullshit! Okay. You really taught that book a lesson. You done? Hmm? Whatever. Like you're gonna believe me. Daniel's always right. Look. Please? <sighs> Listen, Sean. I can't do this on my own. I... I can't. I need you to help me. I know you don't want to babysit Daniel. You grow up, you need space, more freedom. I get it. But we're a trio now, and you gotta take some responsibility. That little shit is just a kid. You're almost an adult. I always look out for him, but I can't stop him from creeping around my room. Even you told him. He's just... spoiled. So were you. And you had eight years of being spoiled before you had to share toys with your little brother. I know it might sound cheesy, but we have to be good role models for him. He's a Diaz, right? Does that mean I have to babysit him all summer? Okay. Maybe you're not ready to grow up yet but you will eventually understand. I'm late for work. Go talk to your brother and work this drama out. We'll go to the movies tonight if you guys don't wreck the house. I know you love to hear this, but I'm proud of you, both of you. Okay, get back to work. Can I come in? It's the big, bad brother. No! Stay out! I said no! Get out! Whatever! I'm not listening! La 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 la! I come don't on, hear dude. anything! La la la! Whoa! Don't know who drew this, but. It's totally rad. Hey, Daniel. Why are you pouting? A young space warrior should never pout. We need to stand strong against the enemy. Come on, man. I'm running out of punchlines here. Leave me alone.
Oh, you kept this guy. We got him from that creepy circus, remember? You wanted him so bad. Got him for you shooting at that freaking target. Yeah, right. Dad, aim the gun. So what? You still won. Because of me. Why are you still here? And don't touch my stuff. Hey. That's cool. Did you make it? Be careful. Whoa. It's fragile. No problem. Suddenly you're Mr. Careful. <sighs> okay, if I sit down. So, when did you get this? Last month. Dad said I should learn to do stuff by myself, since you're not around as much. Hey, come on. It's not like I'm leaving home. You might as well. I never see you. We don't even play games anymore. We don't do anything. Daniel, I just... I want to hang out with my friends sometimes. You're gonna be doing the same thing in a couple of years. Hi. I don't want to grow up. It's boring. Here. Sorry I took it. That's what you wanted? That stupid watch? You said you'd give me one. At the thrift store last week. But you forgot. Like before. Well, you better keep this watch then. Wow! Thanks, Sean! This is so cool! I'll keep it forever and ever. Man, Beaver Creek feels so far away. Hey, bedhead. Had a good sleep? Oh, uh, hi, uh, yeah, I, I did. Thanks. Nice. Okay, I better hit the shower before they use all the water. Right. See you around.
Hey, Sean. Breakfast time. Did you see all that fog earlier? Oh, no more fog. I don't know what sense. What? You hear that? Um, I heard nothing, Penny. Maybe it was the coffee brewing. Never mind. You can't hear? Only me. I don't understand. Why? How you miss all those insects? How the fuck? The swarm is coming. You mean bugs? <laughs> I haven't seen many flying bugs. Not in the winter, at least. Sean. Sean. Narc, stealth drones, all that shit. Wake up, boy. Look up. You saw them? When? How? Because Vision and Sean, they watching us now. That would be shit for me and Anders to lose the job. The cash is good for us to travel. Same here. Plus, this was a steady gig. Don't want to hit the road yet. Daniel won't either. Don't puss out if the narc show. Merrill takes care of his peeps. Yeah, he's a major dick. But fair. He always puts us to work every season. Some of us need this shit job. Not the tourists here. Cush gig. But not when they legalize that shit. Then you can work legal on the farm, right? Not if the government steps in. Then the pigs. Pill pushers? All bad. Well, at least they can't just screw over workers. Like here. What? That means people like you and me will be fucked. No paperwork, no job. Truth. I hear ya. Oh, um... Did anybody see Daniel? I haven't seen him this morning. I saw him walking with Finn. They were headed to the lake. Thanks, Ingrid. I better see what he's up to. Tell him no swimming. That lake is toxic, man. Nasty. Uh, I think you forgot something, Sean. You gonna make some more coffee, right? I keep thinking you're Dutch. Funny how I like being out in the forest now. I actually feel free. What the fuck, man? You're awesome. Come on, once again. Yes! I fucking rule! <laughs> Holy shit! That was dope! What's up, guys? Morning target practice? Six bullseyes in a row. Kid is a fucking ninja! Hey, we didn't want to wake your sleepy ass up. Yeah, thank you for that. You okay, Daniel? Hey, seriously. I've never seen anyone throw like that. Wow. Then trained you well. Six bowl sized dude. Yeah, I got better. Lucky. You can't throw a baseball without hitting me in the nuts. How did you learn to aim so good? Practice. Yeah, right. Hey, wow. What's up with you two? I should have let you know, but, but I'm watching him like a hawk. Seriously, much respect. He's like my own blood. And not that I'm as hot or cool as his big bro. Yo, Sean. Idea. I want to see if Daniel inherited the family blade skills from you. How about a little demo? It was my turn. Come on. Let's give the man a chance. Okay. Yeah. I'll take a shot. Oh, 
Sean. Hold your right arm. Yeah. More like this. Better alignment. Better aim. Won't really help. Dude, what's wrong with you? Between the fucking eyes. Damn. Oh, 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 oh. oh. Did you guys escape from some circus? Mm. That was just luck. Seriously, that shit was off the chain. One time is luck. Second time is skill. So let's see. <laughs> oh, fuck that. <laughs> Missed. See, I rule. <laughs> Sorry, Sean. You're not a ninja. But you're still cool. Just ask your brother for help next time. <laughs> yeah. What would I do without him? Hey, don't look at me. It's not my fault if you can't throw. Whew. After that workout, I need some more fucking Java. Wait! Don't go yet. Ah, uh, it's all good, Daniel. We can practice later. Yeah, if it's cool with... Big brother. <laughs> Love you, man. What now? You think that shit is funny? What shit? Stop acting stupid. You're pushing it, Daniel. You made me miss in front of Finn. What if he finds out, huh? What then? I'm not stupid. He won't find out. You don't know that. You're gonna get busted, Inano. You need to listen to me. Stop calling me that! I'm not a kid anymore! Daniel, don't- Why? See? Stop, Daniel. Now! Or what? I said stop, Daniel! Don't run me! Uh. Uh. I I'm sorry! I, I didn't mean to! I'm okay. It's fine. I told you, you're good, but you don't have control over your powers yet. Yeah, but we stopped training since we got here. You'd rather hang out with your new friends. Well, because we need to fit in if we want to keep that job, okay? But you're right. Let's, um, do some training later today. Cool? Yeah. Let's go by the lake again. But, Sean, how long are we gonna stay here? It's been like a month. I know, but we need more money to get to Puerto Lobos. Remember? It's gonna take forever. You should try and find Mom. Since we have her letter now. No, we shouldn't. I've told you a million times that we can't trust her. She's one of the reasons we're out here. That's why we're going down to Mexico. How come I never get to choose? I'm the one with the power. Dude, that's how it is. I'm the adult now. Okay? Yeah, well, that sucks. Finn treats me like an adult. He understands. Uh oh. Bid Joe. Hey, Daniel, remember what I said. Low profile. Yeah. Okay, we're cool. I don't like working on a farm. I know, it could be way worse. We're making cash, Inano. Okay, okay. Wish we could send Chris a present or something. Or 
Maybe just check on him. We will, Daniel. When we're safe and far away. I know. I had fun playing hide and seek last night. Especially in the dark. You weren't scared at all? <laughs> Come on. Not with Finn. We had the best hiding spot. Sit here, my man. I need a bodyguard like you. Cool. Tell Sean to get me a knife. Mind if I sit here? Sure. <laughs> Why so serious? Uh, nothing. Just thinking. Cool. I'm always worried about my city boy. Everyone here? This isn't a fucking school bus. We're late. So at this point, you know, I'm like, whatever, dude, just right? give me more booze, <laughs> you know? Yeah. I don't bullshit you. Some gutter punk jump. You're not awesome. listening to anything I say. So I'm cutting that. Are you? Yeah. What? Jeez, yes, I am. Cut me too. The party. Oh, shit. Too much, much sex, guys. Are you okay? Too much sex. Shut up. <laughs> I was Two peas in a pod, these ones. I'll show you the battle oh, it was so high last night. Hey, Sean Jellis. Cool. Nah. Uh, just you, you keeping an eye out. With that, you know? Though, yeah. Okay? <laughs> Big brother watching. Hey, who's the next That's master cute. here? On death, did you lock the tent? You want to see stuff for shooting in that email? So, Wrong. how do you feel? You went back for the lighter. Who knew this little tree market snowflake would end up yeah, here? <laughs> with us misfits. Oh, good. Just hope I won't turn into a dirty hippie if I hang around too long. You better stop talking to me, then. I'm the most contagious. Please, don't hurt. Too late. Guess I'll take a chance. Hey! I'm gonna shut the fuck up back there. I can't hear my music. Guess what? He was on his secret sat phone again this morning. Speaking Romanian and shit. Oh no. Here it comes. He's Agent 420. And he has a license to cook. <laughs> um, what's that? Told you a thousand times, Big Joe is a clone. They come from the factory of Silicon Valley. <laughs> Maybe he's just the factory reject. He's just a goon, guys. Bet he worked for some gang. Must have done something bad to end up here. Duh. Boring. <laughs> yeah, boring. Shit, you're all in love with Big Joe. You can't stop talking about him, I swear. But his ass is too big. <laughs> <laughs> right on. Come on. <sighs> yep. <laughs> He's kind of a mystery. <laughs> hey, pipe down back there. Enjoy the scenery for a change, for fuck's sake. Yeah, me too. Let's try to go to bed early tonight, okay? 
Yes, please. And no wheat. All right. Who's ready for another great day in the office? What? Oh. Somebody doesn't want to be employee of the month. I'm so fucking tired. Stop your bitching or get out of here. Hey! Jeez. Sir, yes, sir. Come on, Sean. We're gonna be late. Right. Listen up. I need two teams today. Finn, Penny, Anders, and what's your name will clean up the mess from the storm. Yeah. The rest of you get to sit and trim. Girls gotta sit in their asses while the males are outside? Yeah, right on. Like I wanna go pick up a bunch of shit all over the camp. Hey, you wanna trade places? Shut up, Daniel. You got a deal, kid. Yeah! I get to go outside. Hey! You guys still don't get it. This is work, not a goddamn summer camp. You're not special. There are dozens of hippies like yourselves begging for work at the next town. Kid, your dad should teach you to shut your mouth. Finn, you better watch your guys. Of course, boss. No problem. Okay, so move it. Yeah. You heard the man. Stop fucking around and get in your teams, all right? Hold up. You and me are gonna talk. Remember, I'm only letting you and your brother work here because Finn put in a good word. I know. We really appreciate it. Thanks. Yeah, yeah, no ass kissing, please. Just watch out. Next time your brother fucks up, you're both gone ASAP. Look, I'm not trying to bust your balls, but this is a pot farm and he's a fucking kid. You hear me? Got it. I'll keep him out of the way. You better. This business has enough shit already. Right. I'm gonna go check on him then. How old is he anyway? Oh, uh, nine. He's nine years old. Jeez, tough age. Gotta keep a close eye on him. Not my business, but you got kids? Yeah, a daughter. Twelve years old. Do you... Do you get to see her? Not often, but she needs the money I get out here. Okay, I'm not your buddy. Get the fuck out of here. You got a lot of work to do today. All right, uh, thank you. Hey. You okay? Now for the fun part. I need this all done by tonight. No excuses. So, get on it! All right, we good? Yeah, Finn is playing boss with his crew. I told him they'd all work late if they didn't finish on time. I hope so. Okay, I gotta make some calls. Well, what are you waiting for? You know the drill. What? Dude, this sucks ass. I feel like I'm in prison. Shh. 
Meryl almost kicked us out because of your big mouth. What part of Lalo don't you get? You shouldn't even be here. Sure. I bet you wish I wasn't here. Oh, stop. I can tell. You know exactly what I meant. Oh, I feel you, Daniel. Sometimes I get stir crazy in here, too. Look, I know you guys are having the time of your life here, but I'm not. So shut your mouth. And give me some quiet, for fuck's sake, okay? Well, why do you stick around, then? None of your damn business. <sighs> but I'd be long gone if I had the chance. Trust me. All right, man. Just pick a bud and get to it. Mm -hmm. Hmm. Shit. Yeah. I hate these scissors. Oh, this is nothing. Last spring, we were trimming about two or three pounds a day. Whoa! That's a lot. Yep. Going too fast. I to work overnight all the time. Take your time, dude. Hours straight once. Yeah, trying to forget. I was done with Kush after that. <laughs> Whoa. We are lucky. Right, and then your arms fall off. Fuck all that. This. this game sounds bad, man. What is it? You got work to do. Mine, your own. I should clean my scissors. They're okay. a mess. Whatever, Mr. Grumpy. Jeez. It's called Mustard Party, okay? What? You're playing Mustard Party? Jeez. That's so cool. I used to be on the scoreboard. Cool. I don't care. <laughs> oh, Joseph. Are you not on the scoreboard? Shut up. You got work to do. Ugh. Okay, sweetie? It's okay. You're doing fine. Just slow down if you need to. I know. I will. Thanks, Sean. hurts. Fuck, this is really boring. Oh, poor baby. That's the job. Don't think, just work. Okay. Just don't ask me to smile for the camera all day long. I don't know. We get paid to give haircuts to marijuana. It's kind of cool. Yeah. I'd rather do this all day than be in a stupid classroom. Daniel, you still have to learn stuff. I had to go to school. Yep, you fight like brothers. So cute. <clears throat> Damn, Sean. We really need to do something about your hair. What? what what's wrong with my hair? Are you kidding me? It's hiding your pretty face. I can't allow that. Come on. It's not that bad. Just... Just a mess, yes. But worry not. We've got everything to take care of it at the camp. <laughs> yeah, yeah. We'll see. Yeah. 
But for real, okay. though, if you could snap your fingers and go anywhere. Cassidy, we get it. Over and over. Hey, come on. You don't want to be here. Give me a break. I can't. So what? So I'm allowed to dream a little? You won't get hurt. <laughs> Promise. What about Louisiana? Must be so sweet this time of year. Jesus. Okay, man. <clears throat> come on. Dream big. I'd like to see the pyramids. Or the top of Mount Fuji. Sean Diaz, global traveler. Yeah, stalking Humboldt. No, bitch, bitch, bitch. What's this? Nobody's making you babies work here. No problem. You guys are all the same. Cool, let's be trimigrants. Then you barely work for a month. This is Joe, my life. Come here for a sec. <sighs> Shit, it's always something. <sighs> Can you folks put a lid on it? We got shit to do here. Whoa, whoa, damn. Easy for you to say, cowgirl. Some of us have to work. Please, I bust my ass like everybody else. Uh-huh, don't even. You're always looking for an excuse. Ooh, it's 420. Hey, Sean, let's talk. Ow, my arm hurts. Wah, wah. Get off my crack, Hannah. <sighs> We've been stuck out here for two months. I didn't come out to California to live on a fucking farm. I want to see some water. Are we gonna squat out here forever? Build a house? What? Stop! You know we voted to stay for a while. Once it's legal, Just we ain't got no more job here. Shit. How's it going? Same as always. They want everything by tomorrow. Friday? How are we supposed to... I'm just over this place. Then go! Ugh. Take the fuck off. If we're a family, we stick together. You're on the bus, we're off the bus. Thanks, Mom. Anything else? Yeah. But we don't have the time. Did you fall out of the wrong side of the tent or what? That's not Shit. my problem, Joseph. You're clueless. You know the drill. Do the work. Yeah. Um... Sure. Fuck this shit. Hannah, sorry. I know. Hey, I don't want to fight. It's been a long, crappy week. Just keep it fucking down in here, okay? Cheer up, my little Sean. <laughs> Trust me, it's not as bad as you think. Other farms in the area is just straight down exploit your ass. You gotta be careful with those scissors. They're sharp as fuck. Yeah, no shit. Oh, you'll get scars, but you'll get it. <laughs> Part of the fun. It ain't sexier. Later, Big Joe. Smile, asshole. So, did you have a good day at work, honey? I did. Love the Jerry Springer moment, when Hannah and Cass started picking on each other. <laughs> yeah. They love to start shit with each other. Then get high. Short-term memory loss. Having Kaz around is like a TV show. She can't sit on her ass for more than an hour. Yeah, always been this way. Like these sharks that die if they stop moving, you know? I was the same at school. So glad we're out here now. Uh-huh. No wonder she digs you. So do I. You're a good fit for the family. You <laughs> totally hooked us up. 
A job, cash, friends, safety. John, everybody's cool with you two. <laughs> Daniel is your secret weapon. I don't know. He's way too young for this bullshit. You gotta be zen about this. The more you try and control him, the less you have. It's deep, huh? Swear, he acts just like me. <laughs> That's how I know he's smart. Uh, he's also got a kick-ass hermano. <laughs> yeah, my brothers are like that. Maybe. But he doesn't listen to me anymore. Hey, don't worry. You're in a... Your new group. He's trying to fit in on his own. Bet you're doing it too. Mm-hmm. Trying to be your own person. Not just Daniel's big brother. Sure. But I try to be both, you know. You're a good guy, Sean Diaz. You just need to trust yourself more. I, I know. Losing your family is tough. The world is yours to create a new one. You know what I mean? Yeah. I was pretty sheltered growing up. But now, I'm starting to totally love seeing the world. Well, going to Mexico is the ultimate road trip. If we make it there, dude, who knows? It's pretty scary. So fucking far. Hey, hey, it is, but you have time and a strong, uh, damn it, uh, will. Yeah, N nothing can stop you from going there. It will be all right, Sean. Don't worry. Okay. Therapy's over. Oh, yeah. I gotta move those water tanks for the shower and stuff. It's cool you're doing your part, huh? Finally. Glad I can help. So, Hannah, how long ago did you come here to Humboldt for work? Nine years. I left Santa Fe because it was hell. No money, nobody. Hitched north, worked on farms, learned how to trim. I had to bail after some tweaker tried to attack me up in Arcata. What? That is awful, Hannah. I almost killed that fuck. But I came back to Humboldt because of Finn. I had this sweet deal with Meryl. It is nicer here than other places we saw. Too many junkies and homeless. They go together sometimes. No home. Get high. What the fuck else are you gonna do on the street? Clean it up. We see so much trash in the forest around here. California is very green. But starting to look like shit. Not everybody has time to fucking recycle or compost their shit. Especially when you live off the grid. We all should try. It's everybody's planet, too. Sweden is not perfect, but we try to be more eco-conscious. We only have one planet. Not for long. It's true. We gotta do something. That's what we're saying. Blah fucking blah. Taurus talking shit again. Like you guys have it so hard. We did not say that we did. Tell me again how many hours you spent on a plane during your awesome trip around the world, and then you come crying about hobos spreading garbage in the forest? Good point. Now you're here sponging off us trash on an illegal pot farm with a tourist visa lecturing us. Funny, right? Hannah, I'm sorry. We were not trying to lecture you. We are grateful we found that job, and that you let us stay in the camp with you guys. I know. We're cool. Do you hate us now? You're funny. Don't worry. You'd know if I hated you. All I care about is my family right here. These three gutter punks. The rest? None of my business. Not used to peeling potatoes, huh? A lot of work. I know how to cook. Just not everything. Yet. Yeah, but you hate it. You want a pizza, watch TV, I can tell. Like those kids who come through here all psyched, and they have to bust ass, and they're gone. Like I have a fucking choice. What am I supposed to do? 
Maybe you chose this life, but I didn't. I know, I know. We all got scars of our own. I just fucking hate phonies. Too many here. Crusty backpack doesn't make you one of us. Well, what do I gotta do to pass initiation? Don't be a pussy. Stand up for us. You can't be part of our family unless you open up. This is a family too, not a pit stop. Out in the wild, sharing is caring. I know, just hard to start all over. It's like rewiring my brain. Everything's different. Yes, it is. Been there, long time ago. So, are you satisfied with your life now? I'm grateful for what I have, yeah. Not everything is perfect, but we got balance, prospects. That's way more than I had before. Thanks for taking the time to talk, Hannah. That's cool. Yeah. Anyway, I didn't mean to grill you, Sean. It was a long day. Whoa. Hannah's tough to figure out. Don't fuck with her. Yes, I know. Almost Go done. fill the water tanks. I have one job. How's the dish master? Great. So much fun. How about taking a break to help your big bro move some water barrels? Yes, but you gotta help me first. I'm on it. Step aside. <laughs> yeah, I don't miss doing the dishes. Then why are we doing this? That's it. Finally. Done away for you near the water tank so we can take on those barrels. Oh, I think I will miss it here. Same. But we can't resist the wanderlust. Plus, Portland's waiting for us. <sighs> I think I'll take a nap. Me too. I'm exhausted after today. <sighs> Let's get these over to the kitchen and shower. One step at a time, Sean. Damn. Trimming is hard. How do these guys keep coming back? Let's carry that one to the shower. Penny's all over the place. He'll go anywhere. that one near the shower. <sighs> 
think I made some good trims today. And talking with the girls is always entertaining. Easy money, they said. Yeah, right. Sweet. But can you do it without your power? Well, you never bothered to teach me, so I found my own technique. Onward. Ready to rumble? Fucking A. Hold up. Too many people over there. Let's hit the other side. The other side of that log looked secluded enough to be out of sight. Hey, can you move that tree trunk? Duh. You know what you're doing. Hey! <laughs> Your face! Come on. I wasn't gonna drop it on you. Very funny, man. Okay. Let's have some fun. Hmm, let's try this. I want you to focus on these ugly mushrooms and blow them apart. Dude, I'll blow the shit out of that. I'm waiting. Or maybe you... What the? I told you I rule. Bet it's different here in the summer. Uh, think you can lift all those? I know I can. Whoa, Daniel, that's a, that's amazing. Come on, find something else. Pick a rock, any rock. Okay, and? Let's test your aiming system. Target in sight. Locked and loaded. Awesome! Okay, you're good. Now, let's spice things up a bit. Bring it on. Holy shit! That was not a fair fight. That's right. 
What's next? That was some next level shit, Daniel. Thanks. I've been training on my own sometimes. I know I haven't been around a lot lately. You still have to be careful with it, man. You always want it both ways. Use it, then don't. We just have to make sure you can control it. Well, it's my power, not yours. Whatever. What's wrong with you, man? I don't like this new emo Daniel. You keep throwing your attitude at me for no reason. Sick of it. Am I a bad big brother? Because I hang out with other people? You're always with them! That sucks. Oh, come on, Daniel. Bet you don't even want me around anymore. Don't say that. You know it's always you and me and I know. I mean, never mind. That's it, enough. You're being a brat. I can't say anything without you having a shit fit. We're family. We still have a long way to go. And we have to go together. Right? I know it sucks. But you have to grow up now. Stop it! Stop it, Daniel! No! I got serious munchies. Any chips left? Dude, you scarfed the whole fucking bag. Have another hit. Yeah, yeah. I packed a fat bow. You're getting tired, babe. You shouldn't have made it. Had a long death to leg ducks. I took both roads everywhere. Whoa. You see that shit? It's a fucking UFO. I'm serious, man. Look. They're finally coming to take you back. Tripped on a few words, but y'all are baked, so I'm good. <laughs> good job, sis. So beautiful. Damn. Why you ain't rich and famous? <laughs> I mean, you can hook us up. That was cool, Cassidy. <laughs> Thanks, everyone. I take ass, cash, or grass. <laughs> <clears throat> hint, hint. John. Take a puff, and pass it to your friend. Um, sure. I'll take a hit.
Daniel, no fucking way. How come you can, but I can't? Because I said so. That is all for us. We must sleep. Ah, there go the party animals. What is it, like 10 o'clock? No worry, Finn. We'll party like rock stars tomorrow for our last night. Come on, one more round. Gonna sleep tight. Jeez, I swear every time you play that song, Cass, I see my poor black flag. Oh, man. I'm sorry. Who's black flag? It was my dog back in Colorado until last year. Yeah, something like that. A year ago, we were hopping a train, just me, Finn, and Cass, and black flag. We got caught stealing some shit in some random town. Motherfuckers called the cops on us. I had to run for it. We saw that train from afar and went straight at it. Cops were right behind us. We barely made it. But nobody's able to get Black Flag. Jesus. Yeah, I see him chasing after the train, yapping at me. But I left him there. That's it. End of story. I hope the cops picked him up. Got him a better home. I think about that damn dog every day. Here's to Black Flag. That sucks, Hannah. We lost a dog too, Little Mushroom. It's hard, but shit. That's life. So you gotta walk on. Jeez. Sorry, I ruined the mood. Don't worry, Hans. We can do worse. Let's hear everybody's worst memory. Fair and square. <laughs> Are you serious? Why the fuck not? We all need to say our piece once in a while. Who's up? Penny? Cool. Must stop the violin. Check this out. Say hello to my little friend. Jinx. Met him dumpster diving in New Mexico. It was cool. The boy had issues. Mood swings, delirious, self-harm, fun shit like that. He seemed to get better with me. I think I loved him. He gave me this coin. Said he never gave his trust to no one before. We used to come here every now and then, hook up on cash, but he disappeared. A few miles north from here, in a pot farm just like this one. He went out one night, high as fuck, and zoomed. That was the last time I saw him. Now I gotta hold on to this fucking penny just in case. <coughs> wow. Wasn't there like an investigation? Something? Fuck no. He didn't have no ID, no nothing. Cops don't give a fuck about us. I looked for him for a while, but I couldn't track him down. That sucks, brother. Shit like that happens around here. Plus, the guy needed medication. Sure did. I just hope he's okay. Mm. Maybe I'll run into his crazy ass someday. Who knows? It's a small world. I'll hand him back the trust that he gave me. All right. Bad vibes indeed. Can we do worse? Uh, Jake? Please? Well, just don't laugh. I guess my worst memory is when I lost my faith. Yeah, you mentioned it. What happened? I used to be a sheep. A true mm. believer. I was raised in Haven Point, Nevada. It's a small community. We have this amazing reverend. People line up to listen to her. She's intense. But for some reason, mm. things happened to me and I started doubting myself. It kind of escalated. People said I was trouble. I couldn't get the answers I was looking for. Even from my own folks. I know the feeling. I felt so lost. Wasn't sure what to believe anymore. So I left. I just needed to be alone for a while, you know? 
find the truth by myself. I'm still looking for it. Jacob, my son, maybe we are the truth you were looking for. I'm glad I found you guys. I don't know if I'll ever go back there. Not until I get a signal from God, at least. I hope you can. Bet your family misses you a lot. I miss them too. Just not the other stuff. You probably did the right thing. I hope you find the space and answers you need. Thank you, Sean. What about you, Cassidy? Your turn. Uh, uh-uh. Pass. I already sang a song. <laughs> Figures. What about you, Sean? You obviously don't have to talk about that shit show back in Seattle. But if you have something else... <laughs> Whoa. No. No way, man. I'm too wasted. How about me? You're the man I was waiting for. It's... Not only one bad memory, but they're all about my friends. I feel like I've let everyone down, like Noah and Lila from Seattle, and our doggy mushroom who was killed and taken away by a puma. Then I lost Chris because we had to run away. Again. I'm not sure I'll ever hear from him again. I just left him all alone. But more than anything, I miss my best friend, my dad. Jesus, little man. That's hard. I'm so sorry, Daniel. I told you I'd win. You didn't let anybody down. Life did. Yeah, life is a bitch. We can only go with the flow, like a river. Yeah, that's why I'm not dragging around any bad memories. Come on, bull fucking Oh, you shit, started this man. shit, bitch. Don't punk out now. Uh -huh. yeah, listen, smart asses. I'm just saying you can't change the past. So you just gotta focus on what's next. Memories are just lessons for the future. The future, huh? What's your big plan, Prophet? Wanna know what my plan is? Picture this. A kick-ass beach house in Costa Rica. Sunshine, feet in the sand, sweet ocean view. We'd be one big, fucked up, happy, dysfunctional family. we just chill and, and sing and drink cocktails out of coconuts. Only thing we need is a little cash along the way. And then, boom. <laughs> Jesus fucking Christ. That's your dream? Beach house and coconuts? <laughs> oh, uh, too boring for you? This sounds like my folks' retirement plan to Florida. I don't need anything else than what we already have. Sure, we're working our asses right now, but we can beat it if we want. I'm not gonna settle down. No way. And that's how shit starts, you know? When you start having things of your own, things you ought to defend, property, land, family. What do you think you're missing out on now? Um, coconut cocktails? Well, agree to disagree, fucker. Man, I'm too high for your shit. It's time to crash. And Penny goes down. Peace out, brother. Night, night. Looks like we still have some booze left. Who's in? <laughs> oh, twist my arm. Uh, Teeny tiny drink. And we need to talk about Sean's hippie hair. Boy needs a real haircut. Oh, hell yes he does. <laughs> now it's your turn to get a trim. Karma. I'll call it a day too. Night, everyone. Hey. I'm wiped out. Are you ready for bed yet? No, man, uh, 
I'm gonna hang for a bit. You want me to walk back alone? Oh, so now you're a kid again? <sighs> Have no fear. Finn is here. I'll walk you, little man. Sleep tight, Daniel. <laughs> sweet dreams, sweetie. Now, you belong to us, Diaz. So, let's do something about that shaggy hair. Yeah, let's not. I like my shag. Sean, maybe you haven't noticed, but we have standards here. Fine. Whatever. Cut me up. Atta boy. That's what I like to hear. <laughs> I don't want to end up with a mullet. Or worse. Tell that to your stylist. Don't look at me, boy. I only cut weed. Um, that means... Why, hello, laddie! <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to McNam Hair Salon. Check, please. Yeah? <laughs> uh, step right up! Uh, hey, hey, no stress. You're talking to a pro. Just relax and enjoy the buzz. Now, let's see. Hey, hands off now. Whoa, 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 down, Finn. Why? Hey, what are you doing? Stop. I said, don't worry, Cassidy. Stop <laughs> fooling around. <laughs> ha, ha, ha. Stand fucking straight. Nice. Looking good, Slick. Seriously. I we don't fuck around at McNam Hair Salon. Mmm, <laughs> bit more here. Yes, that's gone. Almost done. Voila. What's the verdict? Hot. <laughs> nice. Okay, can I see now? Whoa. There goes my job at Wall Street. I'm as ugly as you are. Love it. My pleasure. Really. Careful, Sean. People are gonna think you're one of us. <laughs> don't think so, Cass. <laughs> Looks don't mean nothing. Lucky for you. Here, you deserve it. I don't know. I'm already kinda trashed. Plus, I might be hosting tonight. Uh, Finn? I don't know. Maybe. Well, just in case. Can y'all let me get some rest tonight? <laughs> Sean won't be able to sleep either. I'm... cool. So, how long have you two been, um, together? If you don't mind. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> What's so funny? You? That look on your face? Hilarious. Yeah, uh... Hands and I aren't together, sweetheart. We're just fuck buddies. Oh, oh. We're pretty open right. here. Duh. Fuck who you wanna fuck. The end. Or don't. Nobody has to do anything if they're not into it. Yeah. We're not into the whole fucked up system. We make our own rules. You feel us, Sean? Or do we sound like depraved punks to you? No, oh, uh, I totally hear you. I never thought about all this until I met this crazy cool guy on the road. People should do what they want, as long as they don't bother anybody. That's it, laddie. Now you know why we're out here. We can be our true selves. Nobody's telling me whose dick to suck. That's fucking freedom. Right. Does it mean you're into guys and all? Uh, that depends on the position. <laughs> but, yeah, sure. Take a number, Sean. So, what about you? I'm just more into girls, like Jen, back in Seattle, 
She was so hot, man. Uh, so long. Oh, shit. You had a gem? Oh, there goes my chance. Sorry, bro. But you never stood a chance. Oh, s stop ruining everything. Okay, lovebirds. That's it for me. A lot of work tomorrow. Plus, it's payday. Fuck. I could talk all night. But yeah. Don't want Daniel to start whining. Gracias por todo. See ya, my dudes. You gonna swing by, Finn? Of course, sweetie. I'm always swinging. Cool. Buenas noches, Sean. Loving on the hair. Meow. Okay, this is boring. So, everybody, tell me how you're gonna blow your next payday. The usual. Save it till the next one. <laughs> well, ain't we all stingy now? How about a keg offering for your family, or... or some hookers, or cocaine? Oh, please. There's a child here. Mm, I think he's heard worse. Besides, he's our mascot now. Oh, I want to buy a bacon burger and a pepperoni pizza. Then, a box of Choco Chris and, and a red slushie. Oh, hell yes. S screw the hookers. Bring on the Choco Chris. <laughs> Come on, Sean. You gotta treat yourself after all this hard work.
Okay, that's silly. But I really do need another pair of socks. I wash mine overnight, but they're not always dry the next morning. <laughs> He's got cold feet. <laughs> so that's it, huh? You bust your ass all week for nothing? Some of us just got simple needs, princess. Yeah. Like your beach house in Costa Rica? <laughs> okay. Let's get this over with. Finn, Cassidy, Sean, and, uh, you. Jake. Jake, Jacob. Daniel, dude, do you have to do this every week? Adults only. Oh, whatever. I work too. Yes, I know. But we have to keep a low profile. Got it? For the millionth time. Just wait here for a few minutes and don't do anything. Nothing. Jeez. I heard you for the millionth time. I hope so. Okay. We'll be right back. For once, you're all on time. Let's see who wins that farm lotto. Jacob, right? I thought you wouldn't last a day, but you cleaned up. You're all right. Thank you. Thanks. Cassidy, your trims were pretty weak. And Big Joe told me you've been whining a lot. <sighs> Betty did. Look, you can bitch all you want as long as you work. Otherwise, you're just taking up space. So get it together. I know, Meryl. Now for Sean. Very nice trims. Good work, kid. Finn, you saved the pots in the greenhouse. And our asses. That's why you keep coming back. You know it, boss. Uh, how about a raise? <clears throat> yeah. Sorry. Now for the moment you've all been waiting for. You little asshole. What the fuck? Don't touch me, jerk! Don't move! Now explain! That sneaky fucker! He was snooping around your living room! No, I wasn't! I was just bored, so I came in! Uh, shut up, Daniel! Seriously! Let Shh. him go! I told you. Come on, Meryl! He's a kid, not a thief! You want to frisk him? <laughs> Look at him. He's just following his big brother. Your brother needs a lesson. You all need a lesson. So first off, no payday. Uh, oh, fuck that. Boss, no way. Uh, don't do that to us. We earned that money. Sean. You and your brother are, are fired. What? And don't come back or Big Joe will take care of your ass. Please, Meryl. That's bullshit, man. Man, I, I know you're pissed, but Sean is a good worker. Never brought you any losers, right? Sir. Quiet! Shut the fuck up. Sean, I warned you one too many times. We tried your way. Now it's my turn. Okay, Joseph, just teach him a lesson. Let me go! Come on, man. Big Joe, what are you gonna do? He's just a little fucking kid! This ain't your business. Think I like it. It's mine. <gasps> Ow! What? Ugh. Ugh. Okay, okay, who did that? Who did that? Uh, I did. My fault. Uh, look!
Wow. Well, that's it. Believe it or not, told you it would sound crazy. Fuck. That's mental. Exactly. I knew something was up with you guys. Damn, I would be scared shitless. I am. It's all going so fast, I'm fucking lost sometimes. It's okay, Sean. I know what I'm doing. Man. So, Sean, maybe this shit is in your DNA, too. Do you have a superpower? Nada. Zero. Nothing. Trust me. I tried. Really? When? Do you have any idea where it comes from? I mean, it can't be random. Doesn't matter anymore. He's got it. And I have to deal with it. Dude, I have to deal with it too. I mean we, but I'm the big bro here. So I have to make sure that you're safe. Damn, you're so unique, Daniel. That's why I need your word that you'll keep all this to yourself, seriously. Oh, this stays right with us, promise. You can trust us. Jake? I don't know, I mean, this is a big deal, Sean. How long can you keep this a secret? As long as we have to. It's all about keeping Daniel safe. That's my job now, man. What if he has those powers for a reason? Maybe it's our job to help him too. Guide him. What does he mean, Sean? Dude, no. Do not make this into some cosmic bullshit. You still can't tell anybody. Come on. I wouldn't do that to you, Sean. Or Daniel. Oh, this whole thing just blew my mind. I think I need a break. Is that okay? No worries. It's cool. Oh, not after what you guys went through with these bastards. Okay. Talk later. He's right. It's fucking bullshit. I know. Finn, do you swear? I mean it. No worries, sweetheart. I'd never let anything happen to that little guy. <laughs> He's a true rebel. Thanks, man. For real. Ah, uh, hold up. You know, there's a lot of money around here. Oh no. What the fuck are you talking about? Meryl's safe. It's like a fucking ATM. I've seen it. Me too. In the back of the room. How you outlaws gonna get the combination? Me? No fucking way, Finn. Don't pull a kid into your stupid shit. Ugh. Getting a shitload of cash isn't stupid. We can get out of here. So you can be a beach bum? You're so selfish, man. How? Sean and Daniel are out of work. They deserve this. And ripping Meryl off is the only way to do that? Really? And with a fucking kid? You know these assholes are armed, right? I guess. I didn't think about that. Yeah. No shit. <laughs> Don't lecture me. I was just having a brain fart. Let's have a beer and forget about it, Sean. Cool? Deal. Not like I would let you use Daniel anyway. No more of this crap, okay? He just needs his ass kicked once in a while. I think you did. I can tell he was sorry. For him? Yeah. Damn. I'm gonna drink the crap out of this party. <laughs> so should you. Plus, since it's your last night, time for your tattoo. What? 
are you getting a tattoo? Dude, I want one. No, you don't, hipster. We have other things we gotta do. Okay. I know I shouldn't have gone in there. Don't yell. Now there's three more people who know about your power. So what? It's my power, not yours. I trust them. I know, but what if anyone gets scared and calls the cops? You don't know what can happen. Yeah, maybe. We'll just have to be careful then. <sighs> At least we won't have to worry about any of this once we're in Puerto Lobos. Fuck Puerto Lobos. We'll talk later. Okay. Guess everyone's expecting me. Better hit that party. Shit. Are we really getting kicked out of this place? We don't have enough money to go down to Mexico. What the f Hey. Why so sad? What are we supposed to do? I miss. I miss my playbots. What are playbots? Like robot stuff? Play bots. Have a seat. <laughs> Have a beer. To our last night together. And to your next adventure. <laughs> so, what are you gonna do next? <laughs> Figure out what I'm gonna do. Me and Daniel are homeless again. Well, <laughs> when I got out of jail, <laughs> I had nobody but me. My brothers were still in the joint. <laughs> they still are. I stayed with a friend. Nobody could find me. Yeah, then I just said, fuck it. it took off. <laughs> that was it, man. No more family. Just me. Always trying to find a new daddy. Or new bros. Yeah. Stupid. I knew I had to cut everything off. Start over all for myself. That's what you're doing. Yeah. You're starting all over. And now, you just gotta take the next step to build a something for you and Daniel. Right? I have no clue what I want to do anymore. I'm just like, what's the point? We're screwed. That's why you have to keep on keeping on. Nobody said it was easy, but you guys are bad motherfuckers. Yeah. Oh, it's gonna be all right, laddie. You uh, have enough cash for the trip? I doubt it, but we'll see. Hey, it's bullshit after all this. You deserve the lotto for life. Seriously. How are you two gonna get to Mexico? Hitchhike? Walk? Hey, just hear me out, man. There's only one way out of this for you. One way to hook yourself up. Listen, we got this, Sean. Daniel can open that safe with his eyes closed. Come on. No, Meryl's probably wasted. Like every night. You guys can get to Puerto Lobos in style. With a, a nest egg. <laughs> you don't want Daniel to be homeless anymore, right? Huh? Then let's do this. I wouldn't let you in on this if I had any doubt. I can't, Finn. No way. Too dangerous for Daniel. <laughs> nah. See, Daniel is the dangerous one. Nobody can even touch him. You know it. I said no. I bet you're pissed at us because he didn't get paid. 
Uh, I would be too. I'm so sorry, but... Okay. Okay. No stress, man. I respect your decision. Just wanted to help you. And Daniel. Much love to you guys. Yeah. Sucks you have to go tomorrow. Makes me sad. <laughs> Gonna miss you, Sean. Truly. Thanks, Finn. Same here. If I were you, I would be chilling with Cass. <laughs> this is your last night with her. Don't blow it. She'll be a bitch if you don't say goodbye. Do it for me. Go on. Get back to your party. I'm stoned. Gonna zen out. Damn. Thing. You need to land, man. I'd rather work my ass off for months than take that risk. Stubborn, you know? Hey. Everything okay? Diaz, my favorite punk model. I'm gonna leave you guys alone. No, don't. I can go. If I'm interrupting. Or... Don't worry, we're done. I think I need some alone time anyway. See you later. Cheer up, sister. What's going on? Don't worry about that. Secret girl talk. I'm so bummed you guys are leaving. No shit. Are you still going to Mexico? Yeah. At least we have to try. It's cool you have a goal. I can't wait to get the fuck out of here. But they want more cash. Then Finn lacks to get his weed on. So? Leave by yourself. You know what you're doing. Just take off, then hook up with them later. Easier than it sounds. It's not cool being a gal by yourself on the road. I hear you. I mean, I can take care of myself, but... Unlike you, I don't have a psychic bodyguard. <laughs> Whoa, down. Fuck that shit. It's fiesta time. Even if it's our last night here, we'll meet again, Sean. One thing I learned traveling is how small the world is. We already met twice. Why not more? Even if we don't, we'll be fucking cool memories in each other's mind. <laughs> yeah, maybe. But the best way to remember somebody is a tattoo. <laughs> Ready? Wait. Are you serious? Goddamn right. This is like your initiation ritual. Don't be scared. Cass is here. <laughs> Fuck yeah. Let's... Let's do it. Really? Yes. Yes. Here comes your street cred. What's your favorite game? <laughs> yeah, um... I'm not sure I... I'm joking. It'll be super cool. I swear. So, what do you want? Think hard. Um, a wolf? Thingy? But not too cringe, okay? Boy, you won't be disappointed. Here's to your first tattoo, Sean Diaz. All right, put your arm over here. You okay? Uh, yeah, yeah. Um... Hey! Don't move, sweetie. But it fucking hurts. <laughs> what did you think this was? Doodling on your arm with a pen? Don't worry. You won't feel the pain. Eventually. Better? Mm-hmm. Mm My poor city boy. At least I'm sure you'll never forget me now. Where did you get your tattoos? Oh, shit. Lots of places, dude. I get new ones <sighs> all the time. Often when I'm bored or drunk.
Do they all mean something? Nah, I just got them from people I met. Friends, lovers, <laughs> strangers. That's what I care about. <laughs> Whoa, you're like a living canvas or something. Exactly. That's what I like about tattoos. It gives me a piece of everything I want to remember. It feels good, especially when you can't help leaving stuff behind. It does sound good, Cass. I get it. And... I'm done. What do you think? It looks good. Thanks. A lot. I love it. I'm glad you like it. This will keep it warm for the night. You'll need to buy a healing balm when you can. Hey, you know what? I think I'll have a swim in the lake now. Come with me. That was cool. Hope I don't look like a clown. I actually kind of get why they all wear tattoos. Jacob? Feels like you belong. You look bummed. Or really bad. Jeez, Cassidy's crate. Sean, come on! <laughs> oh, fuck. Oh, fuck this. It's freezing. <laughs> it's all in your head. Just don't think about it. <laughs> uh, sure, don't think. <sighs> okay, here I come. I think. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Get over it. Hurry up. There you go. Bring it home. <laughs> Hey, you got to take it all off. No cheating. Oh, shit, shit, shit. My, my balls. <sighs> Cassidy, do not even... You are so... Adorable? Yeah, I know. Not bad, Diaz. Didn't think you'd actually do it. <laughs> My body just had to get used to it. Not that cold. That's because I had to pee. Ha, ha, ha! So, what are you gonna do about Finn and, you know, his plan? It's a really stupid idea. Way too dangerous, especially for Daniel. I know. Finn acts like this is no big deal, but this feels bad. Plus, I don't want you guys to get in any more trouble. Yeah. Tell that to Daniel. He's gonna be pissed. He's your brother. He'll listen to you. Finn wants to take care of us, but... But he doesn't always see other people. It's all about him. I know, but I feel bad for ruining his dream. He'll rage for a while, for sure. Then I'll be cool. He likes you. What do you mean? Come on, heartbreaker. You know everybody likes you. 
I plead guilty. Yeah. I like you too. Oh, Sean. <laughs> That's sweet. I'm flattered. Nor do you bust out this line whenever you go skinny dipping. First time. Swear. Are you sure? I'm not that much of a player, as you can tell. Hmm. I don't know. We're both already naked. Hey, that's your fault. Not that I mind. So, do you want to kiss me? Yes, I do. If that's cool. Yes, it is. See? Now, let's get out of here. <laughs> Damn, Sean. You really are cold. Shut up. Stop looking. Hold on a sec. Okay. <laughs> it's been worse. Sean? Hello? You want me to come inside? If you want to, yeah. Uh, yeah, I do. Then get in, bro. Sorry for the mess. Porters rejected my application. Again. <laughs> Are you cool? Totally. Uh, I'm, I'm just nervous. Kind of bummed we waited till now. No shit. You're kind of a slow player, dude. Now we're all cozy, right? Yeah, um, hey, listen, I, I think you should know that I'm, uh... I know. Don't worry about it, okay? I took a breath of fresh air I took in the view at the top I took a lock of her golden hair I took a look, it was gone If living Is giving I took her heart cause she let me 
I took a walk in the dark I took some time to decide if it was right I took a walk in the dark If living Is giving I'm Hey, ready. what's up? Nothing, I just... Never mind. Come on. Talk to me. Sorry, I, um... Uh, sorry it sucked. Sean, this is your first time. I won't give you a bad review online. Promise. That's, uh, sweet. But you don't have to be like that. Hey, I mean it, Sean. Just take it easy and you'll have time to practice, okay? Okay, we need some fresh air. Let's get dressed. Until we fuck again. Sean, it's all good, okay? Hey, what's happening? Wait, did you guys just have sex? Yeah. <laughs> Kinda. Uh, yep. Did you see Finn? He was with Daniel, but now I can't find him. Well, you didn't see anybody out there, but... We better go now. Figures Daniel is with him. Just... Tell Finn I want to talk. Thanks much. Later. Sean, hold up. Wait a sec. Why? We have to stop them. Let's figure out a plan first. We don't have time for that shit. Well, we have to get to Merrill's before then. You're right. Maybe we can borrow one of Big Joe's trucks. This is so messed up. I told Daniel. Fucking Finn. Hey, get mad later. We got shit to do now. If something happens, fuck me. It's okay. We're gonna get them. Bring them back. Thanks for coming with me, Cassidy. Don't thank me. I'm gonna kill Finn myself. Somebody build a lock. Course. We probably gotta check a car. One truck is missing. See? Those tracks are headed out. Fuck. At least they didn't wake Big Joe up. But if we do, he'll kill us, Sean. So let's not advertise. No lights, no noise. I'll check the car, you do the truck. Figures. Check the other door now. Maybe the car then? Cass, check it out. So, all the doors are locked, but we just gotta get into one car. And I think I can get that truck started. You shitting me? My dad was a mechanic. He once showed me how to hotwire his tow truck, just in case. Sean Diaz, you're full of surprises. Plus, we could uh, mess with all the other cars so Big Joe can't follow us. Love the way you think. We can find some things here to bust shit up, but we can't make a sound.
I can wreck that engine. If I can open the hood. Need to find something to slash these. I can wreck that engine. If I can open the hood. Just gotta get in that truck and start her up. So fucking stupid. Come on, get in there, fucker. Shit! We gotta slash those tires. We need to get the fuck out of here, Diaz. Fuck. We're so busted if we make any more noise. Careful, it's gonna break. Not gonna follow us now, motherfucker. There she blows. Shit, broken. Man, focus. We have to get into that truck. Here goes. One, two. Shit, he's fucking coming. Let's go. Ah, oh, fuck. 
Fuck, 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 fuck. What the hell? They'll be on us in any second now. Fuck, Sean, you did it. Let's get out of here. Drive. Fuck this shit, we did it. But it was so close. Let's do this. wrong after the night we've had. This is basic karma. Shit. Right. I want this to continue, Cass. We should go. They might not even be inside yet. Oh, Finn is out of control. Has he done this before? Fuck us over? Not like this. Why now? Because Finn thinks Daniel is his golden ticket. He just gets greedy. I'm stupid. We gotta catch him. I just don't know if we can ever trust Finn after this shit. I wouldn't. Hannah is gonna... Ah, oh, shit! You scared the shit out of me. Good! Doing? Didn't we settle this, man? Shh! You're gonna wake Meryl! Finn, no fucking way. Come on, Sean. Are you kidding me? How could you do that, Finn? And you're some fucking kid. He's nine years old. He asked me for it. I didn't force him, man. Are you an idiot? He's too young to make that kind of decision. Fuck's sake, Finn. He's an old soul. He knows what's up. Hold on. Please, you're standing near a boatload of cash. We can do this in five minutes, in and out, and then you're off to Mexico. You won't hear about me ever again. We got this, man. Trust me. No means no, Finn. Meryl is right fucking there. Uh, he's a log. Won't even know. I want to help, Sean. We could get out of here. Go to Mexico. He said no fucking way, Sean. Please. We're done, Finn. Come on, Daniel. No, why should I? We couldn't even find you before. You were with her, right? Who gives a shit? Let's go. Now. No, I'm sick of all this. For weeks, you just hang out with her. It's all your fault. I could do what I want. Crazy. The fuck are you doing here? Shit. Don't move. Don't shoot. What the fuck? How many are you? Just us. It's just us. All right, move your asses over there. Now! Uh, Meryl! Uh, <laughs> boss! <laughs> I know this looks bad, but... Stop! I don't want to hear any more of your shit. So, what was your big fucking plan exactly? Work here for a time and then break into my safe? Pathetic. Who was the moron mastermind? Like I didn't know. I gave you punks work when nobody would. A place to crash for free. God damn it, Finn, I told you- Shut up! This is how you repay me? Stealing from me? Uh, no, no, it's not about you. I thought you were different, smart, but you're a real dumbass for getting a kid involved. And you're teaching him how to steal? Thief and brother of the year. Nice. What now? You all really fucked up. 
I can't just let this slide. I can't. You're young, but you can learn from mistakes. That doesn't mean your lesson's gonna be easy. Or painless. Okay. On your knees. Hands on your head. Shit, don't do this. Don't. Come on, sir. We... We could talk. I'm serious. On your knees. Now! Do what he says. Don't worry. We're on our knees, okay? Meryl. No. Finn, just do it! Don't break my balls now, kid. Daniel, you got this. Don't move. Just get on your damn knees! Yeah, now! He can't do this. Don't uh. fucking move! It's not like I want to do this. The people I deal with are worse. But if you rip me off, you rip them off. Then I pay. I have a family to look after too. I gotta protect them first. Can't let you play me anymore. Daniel, do it! Get out! Run! Oh, out, son of a bitch! Sean! Wait! Stop! Oh my god! No! Fuck! <laughs>